Altaria GX. Brighto! Next turn, your opponent's GX Pokemon can't hurt you. I have right tone, so it should not hurt me. Da, 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 na, na, na. If they can't hurt you, how are they gonna win? Latios Prism Star, steal the spotlight! I'm, I need the. Oh! Oh! Well, hello, no girls. In the French shops, it's Don. Welcome back to my kitchen. I know that this menu, I'll be serving you Altaria GX. A GX Pokemon that's easily and always immune to other GX Pokemon. Yeah, there is no combo. You just loaded two energies and your opponent is in trouble. Yep, is it? I mean, is it as good as it sounds? It actually is. So let's talk about the combo Altaria GX, your stage one. Yeah, easy to evolve. That's easy to train up. Not like stage two, which you'll see. 200 HP. Okay, a little bit less than other GX, but that's okay. You have your bright tone attack. Here we go. Fairy energy and any other energy. Yeah, okay, you can squeeze in other decks if you want to, but 50 damage. That's a good base, and you and you already know this part. Your GX Pokemons and EXs can't hurt the Altaria. So now they have to use their weak Pokemon to fight this Altaria. And lucky for them, your Terry isn't doing that much damage. Or so they think. So how do we boost the damage? Fight song! The little Altaria is like, go big Altaria! You can do it brother, sister, older brother, whatever, sibling. Your Dragon's Pokemon do 20 more damage. So this does not do 50. This does 70 or 90 or 110 if you can get all three out, which we do have all three there. It's like, yeah, they're different Pokemons, but you don't have enough Swablu. Well, one of your Pokemon needs to die. Like, really? Uh, how, what do you mean by that? Lance! Yeah, Lance Prism Star. You can play this when one of your Altarios are actually Pokemons knocked out. So for the Drew Dragon Pokemons, it just dropped them in without evolving the Swablu. All right, we don't have uh, Coconut Master. No Tapu Lele here, so it's going to come when it comes. And then if it does, yes, you can get those extra Altarias. You can get pretty much a whole line without having to evolve them. And this ha happens, uh, well, this is good throughout the game. All right, so, hey, you've got other attacks too, but they're not as big as a deal. First of all, Sonic Edge, two shot KOs, and it pierces through everything. Yeah, hey, you're fighting another Altaria? You gotta use Sonic Edge or Hoopas or the sword. Euphoria GX, not gonna be used much either. Your opponent's asleep, and you heal all Pokemons up. Oh, that's nice if you have one or two Altarias that's wounded. But that's very situational, and you're not going to be using this GX much. So your real trump guard is this Latios, Prism Star. What does it do? Dragon Fleet! For every evolved Pokemon! You do 50 damage. Now, I will always include Banana Master somewhere on my bench, so you're only going to have up to f four. Actually, including the front Pokemon, four. So that's 200 damage for two energies. And you know it's not 200, it's actually 220, 240, 270, 280. Devour field, free 10 damage. Yeah, you don't got an Altaria up yet? 10 more! So these low numbers are not very low, they are very, very, very high here. So the big combo is, uh, you got, you got your GX immune attacks, you got your damage boosters, from these two cards, and you have your trump card. All this is an easy, easy combo to set up. You will have zero, zero problems. If you want to tune this deck even further, I have four pads which you can just tune around and mess with. So, is this gonna work? Oh, easily? You bet it's gonna work. No questions asked. It will easily. Let's do this. Welcome to another Altaria GX match. You can play my remix. This is Twilight of the Gods. From Fire Emblem Echoes. So I'm blue up front. I'm going first. I have low hit points, so he may just send out a Lele to finish me off. Either way, I'll still put uh, energy up front. Uh, even if he takes it out, I think I'll still be uh, I'll still be able to come back from it. So the worry thing, worrisome thing is my hit point is low. If I want to be safe, I charge the back. Swab blue. But most efficiently, charge the front one if you're going first. The only thing is, Lele. If he's gonna DC Lele, just knock you out. 
It looks like this opponent is not here. Well, maybe. Nope. Okay, he's here. He's here. Now he's here. It was just AFK. I'm back. Let's finish this coffee up, man. Would you like to draw an extra card? Sure. It's God of War. Oh man, let's take two, huh? I'm gonna go ahead with serious treasure and take away some of these uh, stuff here. Yeah, just have Altaria in my hand for next turn. I need that choice, man. Hold on to Ultra Ball in a bit. Hold on for Lily for next turn. Okay. This time around, I'm thinking I'm gonna uh, play this afterwards. All right, we know what's going for us. It, it might be, was it the same guy? Is this the same, he is this the same guy? Maybe not, maybe it is. We played a, we played a, yeah, we played a Zorark uh, version last turn. He's like, he was able to, nope, this is a different deck. This is a different deck. Get a Guzma hat off. It's like, whatever, I don't got any draw supporters. Let's do this instead. Anyway, yeah, all right. So, here's what we're gonna do. Well, you got me with that Guzmas. Let's nest ball, get them out of the deck. Fill up the bench, because once your bench is filled, you don't need the nest balls. I want all of them, man. You know, since you pulled that out, I'm gonna send you up to fight. That's how it is. Swap blues, let's go. Order pad, I feel like I'm gonna, no. It starts up early, I'm gonna dump it. Banana Master, I'll get the last Swablu later. I, 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 I know I need my Banana Master, man. And this was not here from the last game, so we did, did play a Guard 4 player earlier. Just seeing it was the same guy. Wow. All right, bench completely filled. 100%. Dragon Fleet. It's a very small fleet, but once these things evolve, it'll probably be a very big fleet. And he pulled it out. I'll just attack with it. Curly are coming along, and we're all weak to fairies. Oh, you're stuck. That's not good. Here we go. Banana, oh yeah. Banana Master, this guy got you, Donald. Here you go. Have a Cynthia instead, Lily. Let's Lily now, whether because you don't trust the other guards. Uh, Lily, I don't trust you. I got a bunch of fairy energies. Let's start getting a, a you know, some bonus damage in. Here we go, Ulteria. The fleet is a little bit higher, stronger now. What damage are we at? 120. Pretty good for a Prism Star. Pretty good for a DC damage. Very good for a DC to do that. Just wait until both of these guys go up. He might not be alive around that time though, but he, he's bricked. He is bricked big time. Uh, he's do got a fairy. This will unbrick him, but let's see. Oh, that's gonna be a big target. I need both of you to evolve. You got that, Cynthia? I need you both of these here. Good morning, uh, Kike. I got cold water in my desk, and I also have coffee in the other one. Let's see how it is, Donald. All right, Sylveon, this will unbrick him. Magical Ribbon, search for any three two-card, triple computer search. So now we just gotta do as much free damage as we can to this. Another fight's on Altaria. Who needs the energy? Let's just get you up. And, uh, yeah, these don't, these have low damage. You don't charge them up. The fleet is complete! Somebody's gonna need the energy next turn, so... Full Dragon Fleet is like, I'm sorry, man, but I'm... <laughs> I need, uh... Ooh! Oh, 240 damage. He ain't winning a choice man, too. That's the first time we've seen a complete fleet. That is the first time a complete fleet is out. Nice. So now he gets the energies. Gardevoir is up. It's got one energy. <laughs> wow. That, that is a big stage two combo setup. You need this here and that. It's like, I, I'll, I may not live enough to finish it off. You gotta help me. That's some damage right there. Ooh. All right. 
Let's see what you do. Yeah, weakness damage. He knows. So he needs one more energy to get the KO. Otherwise, that's a dead God of War. In this case, Altaria will come out. It's like, God of War can't touch me. I'm invincible. Uh, wait a minute. Never mind. 180. Ow. For one energy. Jeez. Yeah, weakness. Never mind. There's no way you saved that. Oh, you did your job, buddy. I don't have a Lance Prism Star. So I'll just go ahead and charge this up. There's nothing I really can do. I can Lance out more Altarias, but I don't have Lance. Lance is, uh, I don't have Lele space for Lele as well. So we're gonna do Brighto. 90 damage, that's why you need that choice man. In fact, we could have pulled it too, but we don't know what we were doing. We just wanted just to attack it. Next turn, can we help? Let's see, we did 90. We need the Devoured Field as well. So let's do that later. So now you're GX Pokemon. I'm immune to GXs. I don't care about you, Fairies. You may be my weakness, but you cannot harm me. He has to get Banana Master out. Yeah, Banana Master. Rabambi Gardevoir. He might... He might go for the trick where he just keeps going for my bench line. That was what one of the other Gardevoir deck, and it was... It hurt it because we were bricked. Yep, I'm immune. He's got a Guzma this Altaria out, which last time there was a Zorark pulling it. This time there's not, so that we're not as scared this time. Here we go. Oh, I, to, I forgot the order pad again. Sorry, man. Victory! Not prepared for immunity. Just like a couple of other decks. Altaria is annoying until you build around it. So. Their tails. I keep picking tails a lot. I'm gonna go on the heads. Oh yeah, yeah. Switch it around. Switch it around. Let's do how to train your dragons. Uh, it's it's the medley again. All right, no basics. Okay. Lance, you're here. Oh, cool. Uh, we're not able to dump our hand here as much. We do have plenty of items, though, so hey, hold on to that. I'm going to be going first, so I'm going to be opening with Lily. Perfect. Order pad! Heads or tails? I don't care. Okay, so I, I don't care. Prefer the heads for the nest ball, but if not, it's okay. This turn, it's okay. Put energy up. Could fill up my bench. Let's save this word next turn. Or or another time. I'll just Cynthia and hopefully something will come through. So I'm safe for this turn. Once I evolve use Bright Tone, I should not be wounded by the evolved version. I don't think he made a deck of the baby. The baby one's much stronger. I'm gonna be more afraid of it. If he goes with a big one, yeah! This will be probably for a basic though. What the? Okay, well. It's like, yeah, this is a Oh, maybe he's using it for find a friend and not electric chain. What's that doing there? Lele, too, followed by Lily, is like, oh? Huh? What? I, I, I think it's for this. I think it's for this. I think it's to do 60 damage to my Altaria. He's like, I have a solution. I'll do two hit you with this. He knew. He knows it. He's, he's like, he's expecting it from people. Uh-oh. I'm prepared. This is Zorark. Both of them should be GXs. He's waiting for the DC to load this, uh, the fight with us. Okay. All right. So let's go ahead and get this up. I'm gonna have to trade off the lance because uh, I, I need to, I need basics now. There we go. Swablu. Energy. Let's save the Technoliza. I'll wait to Ultra Ball to Devour Field afterwards. Let's go ahead and use Bright Tone. Yeah. I gotta save those cards, don't I? Yeah. This will make me immune to GX Pokemon. It did 60 damage. Devour Field. That's why. Alright, so he's like, well, I gotta get Dendena out to do this. Luckily, we can just one-shot the Dendena. 
He's prepared. He's prepared. I like you, man. He's like, got it. But, uh, well, it's not going to get me fully. It's not going to get me fully. It's going to do a lot. It's going to do 60 damage only, though. Yeah, you don't have an electric Pokemon on your bench. You might have a Tapu Coco. Wait, that might be the Tapu Coco right there. He are... I, wow. He's prepared. Yep, he's prepared. Finally, a use for the den den <laughs> Dang. Dang. Okay. Well, let's see. I already have the 60 damage to the devoured field. Uh, he may have to fight with me with something else, though. Okay. That means we can do the play another one. And the fight someone is here, too. We also have Lance somewhere. And that will really help me set up if I don't camp on my Swablus. Alright. Water. Altaria. Banana Master. Now let's make sure the swab loose up. Nope. Never, never doubt the ban Banana Master. Banana Master, what can get you for me? Switch. Ah, it's okay. Thank you, though, Banana Master. Let's go ahead and use uh, Flip. Can't Ultra Ball because I need the draws. All right, swab loop. We charge this up to fight, then uh, after that we'll rescue Stretcher. Let's go ahead and use Bright Tone again. Get that Dendena out of there. And here, to, to half my life. Another rescue Stretcher. Okay. But now, <laughs> like, there's no way to get through to this. Let's check, unless he gets to the Guzmas. Which he may have. He may pull, be pulling Guzmas. Zor Arcs, those pools will be coming. That's gonna be a little bit scary. Mallow. Alright. So that may line up for a DC. That's the only thing I, that I can see. Yeah, it rhymed a bit. So we'll take two hits from this, but after that we'll be okay. I mean, I got 80 hit points, we're okay. If I don't attack, I mean, if I be greedy and use the Shonic Edge, it'll be uh, bad. I also have Euphoria GX, which I may use in a bit. We never used a GX before. So I'll do that. Like one Bright Tone and one Euphoria GX. Actually, you know, I wouldn't mind healing myself all the way back to full right now. Because I'm, I'm not in the safe zone right here. But then he may have a good shot at me afterwards. Like, oh yeah, he didn't use this. I mean, I put to sleep. I mean, I might put this to sleep, but then again, I might not. So, it may say asleep. It may not. It should be like paralyzed. It GX. But no, it's just sleep. They may wake up from it right there. All right. He can't play another supporter. He's only gonna get what he wants. Gets. Okay. He's probably playing a goose. He can't play Guzma. You can't play Guzma. Double heads. Yeah! I got those! Just a thin, I suppose. I have bright tone, so it should not hurt me. <laughs> nope! He ain't prepared. I mean, I, I was giving him credit for putting that Dendena out. I was like, yeah! But he ain't fully prepared to take out Altaria. I was like, I'm too strong against GX cards. Yeah! Dang it! Boom! Yes! So you have to prepare your deck for deck somehow. A strong non-GX attacker. Baby Galissopod! That was... I'd be afraid of that one. That one would wreck this deck. So... Heads or tails? Dragon tails. Oh, it's dragon heads. Dragon breath. Let's play Lever Break X Survivor from Dragon Ball Super. This is my be my cover of it. Thank you for the follow, Big Scrap. Alright. How you guys doing this Saturday morning? Swap loose! All up front. Okay. So now we gotta fill up our bench. Evolve our Pokemons. And we got Lily up front too. Good. It depends how... Uh-oh. Hey, Metagross can't hurt me. It can't hurt me. Uh-oh. Well, it's gonna have to go for Plan B. I don't know what Plan B is. I think I do have a weakness to Metal. I'm a Fairy. No, I'm a Dragon Pokemon. I have a weakness to Fairy. That's the total opposite there. So that he might like. He might like. Uh oh. He may not have a solution for this. So we'll just all win here. So we'll see how long he lasts. Yeah, he has the Alga GX too. All right, putting that up. Putting. Why do you have a Water Energy in there? It don't make sense. That means I don't trust the front Swablu because he's playing something. He's playing pretty aggressively. Let's 
play Devoured Field. And I'm gonna I'm gonna back off on that. Alright, I do want more swab blues, then I'm gonna kinda send the Latios and just set up set them over. So I can use that DC. The DC is best spent on the Latios. So we'll load the Latios up, pretend like it's gonna be the next fighter. Save that switch for now. Because I don't have any involved Pokemon, it's zero damage. But I might have soon. Here we go. Swablu. Banana Master. I don't think I can evolve them all. I'll get Banana Master. I don't ever want to be stuck. Like, hey man, you play Cynthia and then you get stuck, which I will play Cynthia. So that is gonna be it. Alright, so if I don't expect this with Metagross, but it does kind of does. Yeah, he could pull it off. So I was like, you know, if that happens, we're gonna need Banana Master or this to take it out. And it looks like, yeah! Okay, we call it right. Oh, Enhanced Hammer? Dang! Uh oh. Uh oh. In that case, Banana Master. Well, at least I have another. I don't know if I have another DC or not. In that case, Banana Master, you go hold, hold, hold the line for me, man. Buddy. Wow! He just took all my stuff away! You took my DC away, you took his- now it's naked! It's like, oh, what happened to my stuff? You stripped me! Okay, well... Let's see, your retreat is- I'm not, I'm not ready to switch. But I also don't want to- want him to take a prize card. So I'll go ahead and switch into this. And then we'll- we'll- Cynthia, because it's just too many supporters. Alright! That's all I got. I need to evolve two of my Swablus in, order, in the next turn. Or we can Ace roll it out instead of Banana Mastery in. Or we just switch it. What? That's a naked Latios. That is a naked, naked Latios. Oh, man. Oh. Oh. Oh, well. I probably have too many supporters this time around. May tone it down, or may just been luck. So, anyways, wonder tag. Okay. Cynthia could have been Lily too. Give him that small of a hand there. You know, five more cards. Just hold on to whatever that is. But no, I'm gonna I'm gonna Lily right now. So we need any of our budget Altarias, or we need Lance. So that means, oh man, it's like I'm not Metagross deck. I'm really a Lola Nine Tails. Like both of us are getting stuck tier two. So we're gonna Cynthia, please give me my Altarias and energies. I have plenty of them. All right. Look at all of them there, man. All those Altarias there, all those Ultra Balls. There's the Apricorn Maker. We'll put Timer Ball in. And this place, there's no room for Lance, unless later when I need to, when I'm down. And I can recycle those. So I can use Dragon Fleet. Come on, just two of those. Two of those. And we get... We can get this. Copycat for only three cards. That's why I have no copycats in my deck. Not one there whatsoever. Yep. Noivern. We're gonna do the no Don't. Don't. Alright. So many hammers. That's... That's... that's I say that's wasted space. Okay. We have more fairy energies than anything. There's our first Altaria. I mean, if they're not, they're all back there now. I know they're all back there. They're coming. They're all coming. Lily, pull me one more. Any of them. All right, timer ball. Don't beat double tails. This sucks. Okay. I was like, you know, I need more timer balls. I do need more time balls. Take the order pads out, put more timer balls in. So, that should have been a free KO, but me, I was like, no, you're going to have more tails than, than normal. So, okay. We should be able to take it out. He may put that energy on, but he doesn't have enough to. He, I mean, he, he, the mix, the mix of Metagross and Nine Tails. And I think the hammers is eating a lot of space that he needs. He's been flipping and flipping, but not hitting the right stuff. So, retreat. And gonna use the Vulpix Beacon to find the right cards he needs. I'll see which cards they are, too. Wow. Alright. There are a lot of removals. They have, luckily for him, been working, though. 
Metal Gross is coming down. Okay. At this point, you know, let's start charging a Swablu. You're gonna be like a fighting Swablu. Here we go. Come on, where are you, Altarius? Get that prize card. Where are you, Altarius? All right, one's in the prize card. That'll do. That'll do. Now they're all gonna be at the end of the deck when they come out. Okay. All right, maybe put in Mysterious Treasure. That actually, you know, we're gonna fix this deck up. This is our first iteration. That'll help. That'll help a lot. Yeah, yeah. I still need the Ultra Ball, so Metal Frying Pan. Gonna send this out. Once the Nine Tails goes down, I mean, we may have to fight. We can't really fight with that. He's really, really stuck big time. All right, let's put a Choice Pan down. Let's get this Altaria up, because this is the Fighting Altaria. He's not gonna be able to fight with that. And... All right, Dragon Fleet! He's like, I'm the star of this. This is not Altaria deck, this is a Latios deck. You see your Altarius? You can't trust them. You can't just trust them. They're all at the back of your deck. They're all at the back of your deck. I'm carrying you to victory, Donald. But I need those Altarius because I do no damage too. So he's he's got a lot of removal, but not the setup is a bit weak here. All right, so first Metagross is up. And it cannot harm the Altaria, so we may just set it out. Just you know, just do some, just go into combat here. Uh oh. Metal frying pan. It's like I'm gonna shut this up. Let's see. I need, I need full, fully charged team. So I'm not there yet. All right, Altarias are coming. One, two, three. One eighty damage. Not good enough. Actually, it's good enough for Lele. I could use Sonic Edge as well. Yeah, it's good enough for Lele. Two prize cards put the pressure up on him. So I'll send this out. I'm going to burn a switch. I'm just going to burn a switch into a old Latios. Uh, energy. Yeah, go ahead. So we can use that final attack there. And uh, but then Master Pool. Come on. Give me uh, give me all of them. Another Guzma. That'll be good. Dragon Fleet. Dragon Fleet is almost assembled. Almost at full tower. 220. Wow. Okay. In fact, that thing's going to be very scared. That thing should be scared. I think it has enough to take me out, though. No? Yeah, it does. Giga Hammer. It's like, I gotta take this out, but you can't take this out. So, uh, let's see. Geotech Systems. Wow. Wow. Maybe we should have saved it. It's good value. What? Well, the Ulterius are now here. Uh, Lance? Can't use Lance. Giga Hammer. Goes down. He can't use Giga Hammer the next attack, so I may be greedy and just go for Sonic Edge. Here we go. Let's charge this up. Let's put the Vower Field up. And we're gonna do Sonic Edge. It's not affected. It might pierce through that. It's 190. Wow! Oh my gosh, that's gonna KO. <laughs> that's that would KO a uh, Buzzwall. Buzzwall's like, oh, please don't. Ow! Ow! That hurts! It's like fight song, baby! Fight song! Yeah! It's like, nope, I'm gotta here, buddies. Bye bye. Max potion. Oh, okay. We'll take this. Then we'll probably, you know, we're not gonna, we're not gonna deal with another most max potion shenanigan. We'll just do bright tone and finish this. Uh oh. Unless this thing can fight. Unless you can evolve this. All right. Well, he still got Acerola. All right. This is. I need the Guzma. I can't really Ultra Ball. I, I don't. I, I can't Ultra Ball. We're gonna do Bright Tone. Here we go. I'm now immune to GX Pokemons and 100 damage Bright Tone. That's one more prize card. I might even not go through the Metagross. We'll just go and just Guzma through it, take it out there. So today, we have a late Altaria party. They were just really, really late. The one way we can fix that, I don't know, it was just a bit of luck. We just uh, decked the Nurses out. Deck looks fun. It's easy, it's much smoother than all those stage two decks that we did tonight, man. You can't hurt me. You can't hurt me. 
You can't hurt me. I still have my lance, man. I would play my lance if you weren't able to take any Pokemon down. That would fill up my bench again with stage, uh, well, fully evolved Pokemons, and that would be pretty awesome. All right, so yeah. Okay, this space, you know what? Screw it. Just Ultra Ball. Another Altaria. Yeah, there's only one. <laughs> Finally, it's like, where were you, man? Oh wait a minute, I won. I'm gonna do it. What am I doing? Pull this here. And we just use Bright Tone and finish it off. Ugh. All right, the anti GXness. That's gonna be annoying. MVP, you are MVP. I'm sorry those cards were. Your Altaria buddies were late, 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 late. So, well, looks like you made it to the end. Thank you, congratulations. It's time we rate this deck, so let's break it down. Unique trait. What's good about you? You're immune to GX Pokemons. That is just your best attack and your most game changing attack. And game changing it is, because it's. Very easy to do. Zygarde's like, what? Why can't I have that? And there's absolutely no penalty to this. So, this is a 5 out of 5. It really... It forces your GXX, your, your opponent's GXX, to fight with your weaker non-GX Pokemons. Which they're probably not set up to do. That is big. This is a 5 out of 5 damage. 4 out of 5. Can you 2 hit KOs? Yes, with both attacks. Damage boosted up. You 2 hit KOs and your one shot is right here. You can also one shot with Altaria, which we saw once you have your full setup up. So it could go to 4.5, 5 or higher. But reliably, it's you feel like it's a 4. You feel like you're two shotting most things and not just chain one shotting them, dunking them. Other decks can do that, not this one. The defense, 4.5 out of 5. Get a little bit extra? Yeah, you're not really healing. You're not a true healing, a big tanky deck, but you do have the GX immunity, and that's gonna cost your opponent time. The games are going to be longer because your opponent can't get to you. So, 4.5 there. Reliability. We only give Zora Arc GX decks a 5. So, Zora Arc GX deck gear, it's not a 5. However, it's also, it gets above average score, which is a 4.5 because, like I said, there is no setup involved. You will set this up. This should probably be a maximum score. If not, that was just a better card that always sets up better. So, you have the next best thing there. Very, very, very good. Very reliable. You have no trouble problems with this deck. A uh, rating, 4.5 out of 5 overall. For now, there's just not a really good uh, counter against this. Until, well, actually, I'm going to take that back. Non-GX decks can count this very well. You go into the theme shop, get that guard chomp, get that Empoleon, and I'll give you the setup on those two soon. This Altarian is not going to stand up against that, so... It's like, what? I can go to the theme shop and beat this? Yeah! So, don't have to worry about that. That's the weakness part. Against GX deck, though, it's like if you're try on the Altaria side, you'll really mess them up. So, alright, what do we have for next time? We're gonna do another Dragon uh, Dragon Majesty uh, GX card. It's gonna be Kingdra! Look, it's a dragon, it's a water Pokemon! It's, it's, it's a dragon too. It's a, it's a dragon type, it's just a water type in the card game. So, one energy all attacks? You know something's up with this. I'll show you next time. So, this is it for now. Thank you, and a gross of friend shows up. Please subscribe, like. I got good things coming for you. I stream live on Twitch. Right now, they didn't happen late at night. Yeah. Patreon. If you support me on Patreon, it helps immensely. Helps with Twitch, YouTube. It helps make everything happen. A Discord link right in the description covers iTunes, Spotify, wherever you like to stream music. That is it for now. So, thank you, and a gross of friend shows. Take it easy. Stay safe. I'm going to see you guys next time. Thank you. Bye bye.